When looking through the comments on my How to Mod BTD6 video, I noticed that many of you were struggling. So today I'm going through every single comment and answering all your questions. In the description, I will also be adding the Melon Loader wiki page. This will be good if you have any questions, because the other link is outdated. The first comment by at TylerRoch7073 is, Even after doing everything here, it just randomly crashes after a second on the Melon Loader loading screen. This actually happened to me before recording. I just had to go to the updated Melon Loader download page and download the official updated Melon Loader installer. This should fix the issue and it should help you when you download it. A simple solution is going and opening .NET Runtime 6.0 and then just pressing the repair button. Also, on this page, if you're having any problems, you can download the other versions of the Melon Loader installer to make it work on your computer. The next comment says, I did that and it still crashes, I don't know what to do. A simple solution is to look right here on your Melon Loader open beta page. This will run you through everything. You can see that my mod helper was outdated and I can update it. When I tried to update it, it didn't work, but the game is still running, so always read this. If you have any problems, you might have to reload the game a couple times. You just need to be able to see what the problem is, and it should usually give you a tutorial on how to fix it. The next comment says, Mine is giving Flamework error. It was not possible to find a compatible Flamework version. What do I do? If you have this problem, you can look up Framework error on Google. Online, there are many lists on what to do with the .NET Framework on Windows. Uh, this might also be a problem with your .NET Runtime 6.0 or your Microsoft Visual C++. All of these could lead to this problem. Uh, you might want to delete older versions of Microsoft Visual C++. If that is not the problem, just look up how to fix framework, because there's not one definitive answer. The next problem says, Hey, I got a problem with the Epic Games one. It says it failed to execute library. To fix this, go into your search bar and search up the BTD6 Epic Games plugin. It'll come up with this GitHub page, which I will also include in the description if you need that and you will simply go over and click and download the most updated release. Go into your Epic Games, right click and press manage on the game. This will open the game's files. I do not have the Epic Games version, but this is what you're going to do. You just grab the source code zip file, and then you can also download this zip file if you need to. All you need to do is while extracting the Melon Loader zip file into the file folder, you need to extract the BTV6 Epic Games plugin. If this does not help the issue, you can look up tutorials on YouTube. There are some really good ones that help with this. The next comment says, I can't use Mod Browser because every time I do, it crashes. Um, this could just be a problem with your computer. If it isn't, just reinstall every program. Make sure you're getting the updated versions. And there's not a specific f fix for this issue. So just go to the Melon Loader wiki page and scroll down until you find something that could be relating to the issue. I had the mod and everything, but not the mods button I showed. Um, this could simply because you're downloading an outdated version of the mod helper. You're gonna have to look up BTD6 Melon Loader in the search bar. Go to a GitHub page and re-download the more updated version of the mod helper. This should fix the issue and have the mods button. Next time it says, how do you uninstall everything for mods? Go to Melon Loader Installer. Select the game and you can press the uninstall button. The next comment says, if you extract, you don't get the mod folder. Make sure you're pressing extract all, uh, and you're extracting everything into the right place. Because if you don't, then it's not, it's just not going to work. You need to make sure every file is getting put into BTP6. The next comment says, it keeps saying training monkeys failed. This actually isn't an issue. I have this plenty of times. It'll just say training monkeys failed over and over, and that can get kind of annoying. But the game should still run completely fine. I hope this video helped you out. If it didn't, remember to check the wiki page for any other concerns you have and search for forums online. Make sure to subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed. Bye.